Hey everyone, this is Andrew Ty and welcome to my YouTube channel. So Apple have just announced refreshes for the iPad and iPad Pro devices. And what's especially exciting is the fact that the iPad is now getting the M2 chip. But within the announcement, they also managed to reveal the existence of an app that people have been waiting a really long time for, and that is DaVinci Resolve. So if you didn't already know, DaVinci Resolve is a very powerful video editing suite from Blackmagic Design. It's been available on Windows and Mac, and is actually native ARM optimized for the M1 and M2 chip. So really, it was only a matter of time for this to come to iPadOS. Judging from the marketing materials and the video, it really looks like the DaVinci Resolve user interface is pretty much identical to the desktop versions, especially the Mac version. And DaVinci Resolve is also going to join a bunch of new pro apps for the iPadOS, including Photoshop, Affinity Publisher 2, and Octane X. However, it still remains to be seen whether this version of DaVinci Resolve on iPadOS is going to offer a free version like there is on Windows and Mac. On the desktop, you can pretty much use DaVinci Resolve as a fully featured video editor. It's possible to pay to upgrade, but there aren't that many features that the average end user will actually require. But it'll be really interesting to see how it's actually monetized and how it performs on the M2 chip. Once more details are released, I'll be sure to make a video about DaVinci Resolve on iPad in the future. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like, please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.